Hi. Tech Rabbit here. Um, I've been experiencing problems trying to copy files from my um, iPhone XS Max to the uh, Windows 10 PC I've had. You got like dis it disconnects the device and crashes in the copying when you try to copy over photos or videos. I did some uh, YouTube searching and found many different comments about this problem and um, but nobody really seemed to know exactly what setting was the one to, that would fix the problem. So I did some research myself and um, I think I found um, a few settings that, or actually one setting that's probably the key in, in this case. Um, So, if you go to the um, uh, photo settings in the iPhone, and there's a few things that are, are good to check. Uh, uh, for the first one is to um, check that you have um, download and keep original set. what happens is the according to the document or what I read up on is the when you take a, a film or a movie and then you um, have it on the phone it will start um, it will um, generate it will regenerate it to be a lower quality movie for the phone usage and uh, dump the um, high resolution version of it onto the iCloud and I think what's happening is that when you issue a copy command through the when it's connected as USB drive and the USB drive basically tries to use the file copy command and the file is actually not directly available so then it crashes. I think probably if you're running it connecting it to a to a Mac then um, what will happen is the Mac will wake up and say okay oh, this needs to be retrieved from iCloud first and then it will get it from iCloud and then copy it over to the Mac. And um, the other setting that I think should be um, changed is um, let's see, what's that? Yeah. it's the last option on the settings, which is to say that it should keep the original format. So what happens that when you're transferring movies and and, and pictures to the PC then it will try and convert it to a more optimal format for the PC and I think what happens is then you get a possible delay in doing that and then the, t the copying times out especially if, you, if it has to first re-encode a larger video file for transport and then, then it won't work probably crash out and um, so what I did is I said, okay, keep the original format. But then I noticed that it wanted to download one additional codec to my uh, PC. Uh, have C video extensions from Microsoft Store. And I had to actually pay one dollar <laughs> to get it on the PC. Anyway, that was just a short one. I hope that helps. I've done loads of copying um, of whole directories, uh, the whole um, images directory with all many many movies and, and, and pictures and done it multiple times as a test and then now it seems to be rock solid and it doesn't matter if you connect it to USB 2 or USB 3 port or USB 3 hub so I've done all that kind of testing so now it's, it seems to be stable as a rock so I think that yeah but I think that the main main setting was to, to do with this um, you know keep keep originals is important that they are actually on the iPhone and not transport it off to the iCloud prior to uh, copy. Anyway, if you like this video, then consider subscribing and um, hit the bell for more content as it appears. I'll just, um, yeah.
thought I'd post this as a help to those other people ripping their hair out and wondering why they can't copy files reliably from off their iPhone. So, see you in the next one.